Hey, only one hour until Black Ops release. Pretty cool. This is uh, first time I've ever I've ever been. What do you mean? Well, I haven't been playing online that long anyway. But uh, this is the first time I'm going to be there since the release. Uh, when I jumped in to what Modern Warfare 2, that was in April. So what about? about half a year after it was released so I missed out on a lot um, I should have mine uh, I'm not gonna have it well I'm, I'm getting it in the mail on the release date on the 9th but when I get it is in question because I have things shipped to my girlfriend's and she lives quite a distance away, so. But she is real. I do actually have a girlfriend. Uh, just in case you're wondering. Because I am a geek. And sometimes we uh, kind of stretch the truth. Like, uh, might have a model girlfriend up in Canada or something like that. Right here, I just want to point out my mistake. When I got that kill, I thought thought I had actually got him but my claymore did so when I came back uh, around the corner he just popped out and got an easy kill because uh, my health was pretty low um, so uh, back to what I was saying about black ops um, I'm probably gonna wait uh, a couple days uh, so that uh, I'll just get it uh, get it from her when I see it, when I planned on seeing her next. So that will probably be early Thursday morning. And I actually have that day off, so I'll probably be playing it most, uh, most of the day. Um, I'll just be, uh, camped out, I should say, in my house, and just trying to tear it up. Trying to add that, uh, what is it? It's no longer points. It's it's like uh, they call it cash, or maybe they call it currency. I'm not sure. But I've been uh, watching a lot of the videos and getting a lot of tips on what you should buy first, things of that nature. Oh, sorry if you uh, hear my heater in the background. Kind of loud. But. Uh, Who's, uh, there we go, Cookie9861, just want to give a quick shout out. He or she was nice enough to send me a little uh, message saying good match at the end, uh, which I thought was nice. Um, but uh, they actually got a much better score than I did. Um, their KD, uh, what was it? Uh, I think the score ended up being 27 and 5, uh, which was better than mine. I think I end up getting a 30 13. And they actually started way after I did. I think they were down, I forgot what my score was. I think I was at uh, 750, so what is that? 15? I think I was either. Um, I think I was around that. Maybe it was more like 14 down by the time they jumped in. But I, ooh, almost got stuck with Semtex right on the forehead. But when I play this map, I usually camp in one of these two apartments. This one being the most preferred because I think, as far as I know, this is the only way in. Um, people usually noob tube uh, the crap out of those uh, those windows and usually get a kill. But uh, for this whole match, I just somehow I, I dodged them. And you can see I'm using the P90. Um, I'm running FMJs on it because I'm going for the extended mags. I just recently finished my uh, 
extended memories for the UMP. So I thought this would be the next uh, best SMG uh, to finish out. And you see how that guy, uh, how the person uh, pushed their way through uh, my fast rate of fire? That was insane. I'm guessing that was a that was Commando that helped him out on that one. But what's cool about uh, heavy campsites like this and like the cave and uh, wasteland is those sites will be littered with uh, scavenger packs. So it's just endless claymores or you know if you're a noob tuber or something uh, you'll have an endless supply of those. So here's the start of Cookie's air support and they're just going to tear it up all from this point. It's a good thing uh, got a drop shot for the win. If I would, if I was standing up at that uh, during that gunfight, I totally would have lost. Claymores were a big part of my success success in this match because it's like things like this. As soon as I, uh, as soon as I plant them. If, uh, if I didn't have him there, that person would have ran up right behind me and got the kill. Oh, there's somebody right there. Watch how long it takes me to line up this shot and control bursts for the win. I don't know if I threw off their aim with the noob tube, but uh, it exploded right above me, so... I just, uh... What, uh... Ooh, another one right across the forehead. What's up with that, man? See, this match, I was, you know, I was just avoiding them. So, here comes the game-winning kill. Drop shot, as usual. I think most of my winning kills are drop shots. Um, are almost, actually, all my shots are almost drop shots. It's, it's just a normal thing I do. Ever since I went to tactical, it's it's just become natural. So should be recording Black Ops pretty soon and uh, posting those. Not fast as if you're if you're a normal viewer of my channel, but uh, I'll try to get them up as soon as possible. All right, see you guys.